crossing and welcome to monday i hope you had a wonderful weekend the weather was absolutely perfect well central we only have nine more days of school left and for you seniors you only have four how insane is that we are so close to the finish line but this is no time to give up or lose motivation you can make it little flying space rocks good morning central Final exams are coming up. So as Sophia said, this is no time to give up or lose motivation. So crack open those books and get studying. And besties, don't try to osmosis because that isn't going to work. Trust me, I tried it last year. Well, talking about final exams, I think I failed my great final exam. What? Why? Because it's always in my Achilles elbow. <laughs> well, after that joke, I think my airtime is done for. So let's go to Sophia. Well, I like to study by osmosis. I don't see the issue here. Anywho, John, please tell us that the weather will be just as perfect this week as it was for the weekend. Weather, weather with John. John. Hey guys, I'm John, the one and only, and today, yes actually, our low will be 70 degrees, skies will be partly cloudy, and our high will be hitting the 80s again, 83 to be exact, and will still be partly cloudy as well. And also, not that much breeze to cool us off, so that's kind of the downside. But yeah, that's all I got for you guys today. On to you, and have a solid Monday. Thanks, John. That weather has me so excited for summertime. Well... First up, good luck to all you Comet athletes that are still competing. Crush them out there. Next, we have some result news. This past Saturday, our track team competed at the Division I District II Track and Field Championship. Great job goes to Hannah Scoggin, Anaya Sierra, and Joey Taylor. The 4 by 200 meter team of Alec Boyd, AJ Farmer, Joss Kojo, and Dylan Adams. And a momentous congratulations to Joey Taylor for qualifying for the regional meet by running a seven second personal record and placing third in the 800 meter with a blazing time of a minute and 59.6 seconds. The regionals are Friday at Pickerington North High School. Go, Joey, and once again, congratulations. Go, Comets. Well, that's all we have for you guys today for sports. So on to Aaliyah and Talasia. Thanks, guys. We have some building news. As we've been reporting all month, May is Mental Health Awareness Month. If you need help, here are some resources you can reach out to. First, the National Suicide Prevention Hotline. It is available 24-7, 365 days a year. Next is Nationwide Children's Hospital. They are also available 24-7, 365 days a year. Note that there is a different number depending on your age. You can also text hello to the number below. And then there will be an automated system that will ask you a few questions and then connect you with a real person. Plus, this week, we have some fun activities to help you relax and keep cool these last nine days. Tuesday is No Tech Tuesday in the ERC. Wednesday is Calming with Coloring. Thursday, we have Lunch Break Yoga. And then on Friday, we've got Mindfulness in the Auditorium. And while there is no organized activity for today, you guys can practice some mindfulness. You know, get ready for Friday. Just take some time to clear your mind, de-stress, and do some calming breathing. My favorite breath is called the grounding 54321 breath. While taking deep breaths, you name five things you can see, four you can feel, three you can hear, two you can smell, and one thing you like about yourself. 
In other news, the YMCA has been awarded a sizable grant that we use to pay students to help beautify work through the community over the summer. This is a great opportunity for students to earn some money and do something positive for the community. Along with that, over the next few days to send off our senior class, we will take a look at a few members of our top 25. Hi, my name is Amani, and I'll be going to The Ohio State University in the fall to study communications and journalism. Advice I would like to share is to use this time to get to know yourself as an individual so that the decisions you make will help yourself on your path to success and be okay with the fact that this path will not be similar to your friends or your peers. Thank you. Hi, um, I'm Ally Miller. I plan to attend Wittenberg University after um, high school and um, my biggest piece of advice is don't be afraid to ask questions and like always try stuff in on time. Hi, my name is George Porterfield. I'm going to OSU for computer science, and I just say just keep doing the school and just don't get deterred. Hi, my name is Rebecca. I will be going to Ohio State next year, and my advice for the underclassmen is to find a good balance between your studies and having fun outside of school. Hi, my name is Isabella Shishlo. I am going to uh, OSU next year for nursing, and my advice is to find um, a hobby that you really like to do so whenever like school gets really stressful you have something to rely on to relieve stress. Hi my name is Gunnar Schmidt. Um, I plan to attend Bowling Green State University and study computer science after high school um, and a piece of advice I would give is to study when you can um, and to talk to your teachers. Hi my name is Jessica Huckleberry and in the fall I will be attending the University of Cincinnati to major in biology. If I could recommend one thing, it would be to uh, work ahead and space out your studying. It definitely helps ease the workload. Congratulations to you all. You've worked so hard to receive this achievement. Again, we will look at more Top 25 over the next few days. Well, our time is up. On to the most trusted news source and that other guy. What's well, poppin' Central Crossing? Logan and I have some club news. Well, looking forward to this week, the final Comet Crazies meeting of the year will be held Wednesday, May 26th at 7.30 in room 264. Crazies, bring your summer schedules, fundraising ideas, and some theme suggestions for the fall. Also, the Outdoor Comet Club is meeting at Scioto Grove Metro Park this Wednesday from 4.30 to 6.30 p.m. Very fun evening of fishing. We will be providing some fishing gear, bait, and refreshments, but bring your own gear if you have it. No fishing license is necessary for this event only. You must sign up in room 237 or the school store to attend this event. See Ms. Chrisman or Mr. Gottschall with any questions. And then this Friday, we have both GSA and Chess Club. GSA will meet in room 281 and Chess Club will meet in room 209. Both of these amazing, wonderful, and spectacular clubs start at 3.30. Hi, Central. Today is National Brothers Day. So if you have a brother, show him some love. I don't really like mine, but you might like yours. And now for Friday's trivia questions answered. The most famous nickname for Texas is the Lone Star State. And the current trivia question, what is the highest grossing film of all time? Tune in tomorrow to find out the answer. That is a very great question. And I've got one too. What do you call a cow in an earthquake? A milkshake. <sighs> yeah. That's all for your most trusted news source. CCHS News, signing out.